home buyers and sellers, the Arlington condo market has actually done fairly well as we approach the end of the of the third quarter. Um, I will be publishing a video next week about interest rates and how the Fed rate uh, impacts that. So when interest rates are a little lower, obviously that means there may be not as many buyers out there and some sellers may be hesitant to put their home on the market, which may explain why the inventory year to date for Arlington condos, we've only we've had about 185 homes sell, I mean be listed this year compared to 239 last year. So again, watch this video to the end to, to get some more explanation on that. But we currently have 18 homes on the market compared to 31 last year at the same time. So that's a large drop in inventory. Days on market though is the same, 28 days on market for those homes currently on the market. The average list price for the homes is 1,005,822 uh, versus last year, it's 991,613. So we've seen you know an increase there in pricing. Now for listings taken year to date, as I mentioned before, we've seen you know a, about a 22.59% drop uh, with 100 units taken this year compared to 239 last year. What is different though is that the original list price was up by at least 5%. So the list price for units taken initially was 838,700 versus 797,828. So people rose their prices this year, um, even though we did have interest rates cut around probably this time last year. So for units under agreement, we've had 170 homes go under agreement versus 190 last year. It's about 10.53% decrease. And the average list price of those homes when they went under agreement was 817,581 versus last year was 741,723. And the days to offer is not too different. Uh, days to offer for those units was 18 days versus last year was 15. Now for price changes, we've had 25 homes have price changes versus 53 around this time last year. So that that's pretty good. Homes have been holding onto their initial list price at least. But the average original list price of those homes was much higher this year. It was 961000 828 versus 899,194. Now for sales, we've had 161 condos sell year to date versus 173 last year. So that's not too bad. That's about 6.94% difference. Days on market was slightly longer this year. It's about 30 days compared to 22 last year. And good news is that the average sale price was Eight hundred fifty thousand four hundred seventy-five dollars versus eight hundred four thousand two hundred seventeen dollars. That's about five and three quarter percent increase. Also, homes have been solding for about three point five eight percent above list price versus four point five nine percent last year. Now, for expired listings, we've had about twenty-eight listings expire this year compared to thirty-five last year. It's about a twenty percent drop. Uh, however, the average list price was significantly higher this year, 964500 versus last year's 639000 and the days of market um, almost doubled. It was 64 days on market versus 33 days on market. Now, I'm not sure if there's perhaps, you know, people still kind of adjusting to the different environment that we're in right now with, with interest rates and such. Uh, sometimes people get used to pricing their homes one way or another. This is agents or sellers, and the market may have just taken them a bit by surprise. So what we're seeing then, as I mentioned earlier, is that I'm going to be publishing a video next week. You can find it on my YouTube channel. The playlist is a mortgage-related playlist. And basically it's talking about how the Federal Reserve holds the key to lower mortgage rates. And that the Fed is unlikely to cut the Fed funds rate until they see core inflation of around 2%. Now, back in August, interest, the rate was 4.3%, which is a large improvement from where it was at 7%. That basically 
is good news. It looks like we're headed in the right direction anyway. So that's it for now. If you have any questions, please go ahead and put them in the comment section below and I get back to you. Please like this video and share with your family and friends. Take care. Have a great day.